This will be a 140 Q&A practice test. Plaintiff attorney, Mr. Sanders, capital S-A-N-D-E-R-S. -E Defense attorney, Ms. M.S. period, Reyes, capital R-E-Y-E-S. And we'll start with the defense. Ready? The motorcycle that was involved in the accident, can you describe it at all? Other than that part that went flying in the air, no. Okay, what color was that part? Do you remember? Dark color, I don't remember. Okay, and you mentioned that the van was a dark color. Can you, I thought so, be more specific? No. So other than just a dark color, right. You, you can't be more specific than that. You mean the brand? No, I can't. I'm sorry. That's okay. When you got into the straightaway, the 500 feet before the accident happened, you indicated that the motorcycle that was involved in the accident was traveling at a safe distance behind you. You thought that was about maybe 20 to 30 feet, correct, or three car lengths? Three car lengths, right, yeah, that's what you said. I think she said three car lengths or so, or so, yeah. Okay, how fast was the motorcycle traveling that three car lengths? Was it keeping pace with you? Well, since he was keeping pace with me at that moment, and so that was about 40-ish. So as you were traveling down that straightaway, and you said that the van came to a sudden stop? Yes. Did you see the brake lights of the van come on? Yes. Okay, for how long? Did you notice the brake lights on just a second and the the van stopped or came to that stop before the intersection with Morris Canyon? Is that what your testimony was? Can I say something? Yes, and keep saying intersection. You're talking about a cross intersection. There wasn't one. Okay, just so you know, ma'am, there's really no dispute in this case that, and I'm just trying to be fair, if it helps you, great. If it doesn't, no problem. But the, when the lady went, it was Morris Canyon. I mean, that was where the accident happened. All right, okay, because I didn't notice any street signs, no problem, or markings about that. It seemed like just a road or a bigger driveway, right. That's what it seemed like to me. It's throwing me off when you say Morris Canyon. It doesn't seem like it's right there. I'm not here to say it was exactly at Morris Canyon. I don't think it was. The area was in the area of Morris Canyon. I'll let you do the testifying. Right, and when we talk about intersection, it's not always a like a cross intersection. I realize that usually there's some kind of a sign that tells you the name of the street at least and I didn't think there was anything there. Had you ever noticed the street sign for Morris Canyon Road before this accident? Yes. Happened? Yeah. So you knew where Morris Canyon Road was? Yeah. And on the day of the accident, as you were going down that straightaway, uh-huh, within the 500 feet before the accident happened, did you notice the street sign for Morris Canyon? No. Okay, is it your belief that, or is it your testimony that the van was trying to turn before the, the roadway that comprises Morris Canyon Road? Yes. Is there a home on Maine? You can't see it if there is one there. A lot of homes are way back behind gates and long driveways, so you can't always see them. Is there a driveway that comes out that spills out 
onto Morris or onto Main Highway just east of that intersection. Something kind of a driveway or a roadway. Okay. It may have been she was trying to make a U-turn too. I don't know if it was the case. I'm not sure what she was doing. Well, okay, but we'd like to get Mrs. Harrison's testimony. No, I know you're not trying to trick her, though. I'm not trying to trick her. Just trying to get her memory, that's all. And you're doing fine. So as the brake lights for the van came on, uh-huh, what kind of a movement, if any, was the van making a left-hand turn? Okay, and how fast was the van moving into that left-hand turn? Didn't, she wasn't, she wasn't moving at all. In other words, she, her brake lights went on and she just made her left-hand turn, but she didn't, she wasn't moving. You're signaling with your hands, ma'am. She stopped for a, and we haven't got a video. Okay, and so you're saying when the brake lights came on, she stopped, and then she made her left-hand turn? Yes, immediately. Okay, so, right. So if I'm understanding your testimony correctly, you, the van was about six or seven car lengths ahead of you, correct, and you saw her brake lights come on? Yes, for one second approximately, and then she, the van was turning towards the left, yes, at an angle, perhaps 45 degrees, yes. All right, the word list. Morris Canyon, capital M-O-R-R-I-S, new word, capital C-A-N-Y-O-N. And then we also had Morris Canyon Road, so capital R on road. Main, capital M-A-I-N. Main Highway, so capital H on highway. Harrison, capital H-A. R R I S O N Mrs. Harrison And that will do it for the word list. And that will conclude our 140 Q&A practice test.